Dezo Wireless Dash versus Realme Birds Wireless 2 Neo. Which one is the best neckband earphone? Let's find out. Hey, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video, if you want to find the best deals on these earphones, you can head to the first link in the description below. As far as the unboxing goes, here are the shipping boxes. Let's snap them open. Talking about the overall design and build quality, both of these devices are quite solid. Dezo is the sub-brand of Realme but I haven't noticed any kind of major build quality differences between them. As far as the design goes, you will find the Dezo wireless to be a bit heavy and bulky as compared to the Realme Neo. Personally, I like the carbon fiber texture on the Dezo wireless dash but you can pick whichever one you like. Moving on to the comfort and fitting, both earpieces are exactly same so there is no difference in terms of comfort and fitting but overall these are quite comfortable, I was able to use them for long sessions without any problem and fitting wise you cannot expect much as there are no ear hooks so this is only for the walking and casual workout. Both earphones comes with a lot of features and Realme has put in same features on both of these devices. What? except there is Bluetooth 5.2 on the Dizzo and Bluetooth 5.0 on the Neo. Other than that, these are the common features you will find on both of these devices. Magnetic earbuds with auto on and off, plus auto pause, IPX4 for the water rating, both works with the Realme Link app where you can change these multifunction buttons and update the firmware, change sound type and much more. For gaming we get low latency mode or gaming mode which can be turned on from the Realme Link app or you can assign that to a button from the Realme Link app. Let's see how it performs. I will use iPhone 11 Pro for this test as it has very low latency. For calling we have an inline mic which has a feature called environment noise cancellation mic. Let's hear it out. This is the audio quality test of the Dezo wireless dash. And this is the audio quality test of the Realme Birds wireless 2 Neo. Coming down to the battery life we get unknown amount of battery image on the Realme Neo and on the other hand we get 260mAh battery on the wireless dash. Both are equipped with fast charging that is 10 minutes of charge would give you 120 minutes of playback on the Neo and 10 hours on the dash at 50% of volume. To fully charge the device it takes about 15 minutes on the dash and a lifetime on the Neo. Yeah, I mean two hours and after that you can expect about 30 hours of playback on the dash and 17 hours on the Neo at 50% of volume, poor Neo. There is no doubt that dash has better battery life than the Neo. Well, 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 here comes the most crucial part of any audio device, which is the sound quality itself. For the driver size, we get 11.2mm driver on both of these devices and in terms of sound quality, they both perform great. Haha. <laughs> That's it for the review. This is why you watched like a five minute video. I was kidding. No, but they perform equally great. I had the opportunity to like test both of these out like side by side. I have the opportunity as I have both of these devices in front of me. And I did find a minor improvement on the Dezo wireless dash. It sounded a little bit better than the Neo, especially in the bass and clarity and loudness. Overall, it's like five to 7% of improvement, but overall they perform great. Bass mids and highs are awesome on these earphones. But if you are about to buy any of these earphones, then why not to pick up the better one, the better sounding, the Dezo Wireless Dash. Again, a link to best deals would be in the description below, but for the sound, they both perform great. So you won't be disappointed in terms of sound quality, bass, mids, highs, everything is good. They are clear and you won't feel like there is no bass at all. I mean, they are great sounding earphones. So overall they both are great pair of neck band earphones but if you are in the market and trying to decide between the two then I would suggest you to go with the Dezo wireless dash as you will be getting Bluetooth 5.2 fast charging along with 30 hours of playback and better sound quality. There is not much of a price difference. Realme Birds 2 Neo is for like 1500 rupees and sometimes you can find deals for 1300 rupees. For the Dezo it's 1400. Now it's your turn to decide and that's it for my side. Hope you guys found this video helpful and if it was please let me know in the comments below and don't forget to come back this Saturday 7pm for a new video. Like, share, subscribe, stay safe, bye.